in the heat of summer, it's sweater weather. And the goal right out in front, there's Denis, he scores! At least hockey sweater weather. People are like, when is the date? When can we get tickets? Because the Whalers return means so much to so many. It's back, the time when baselines and blue lines are blurred. <laughs> Brass Bonanza because Hartford Whalers Alumni Weekend has returned to Duncan Park. The Yard Goats bring in former Whalers from across North America. This year, 19 are here, including centerman Andre Lacroix. Let's face it, a lot of these guys, Jimmy, we haven't seen in 30 years. And this is one weekend that I look forward to every year. For Whalers forward Scott Daniels, being back on Main Street is like memory lane. I scored my uh, first NHL goal right over there. It was uh, a little wrap around a corner against a, uh, a French Canadian goaltender. I'm not too sure his name, maybe uh, Patrick Raw. <laughs> Chuck Caton was the radio voice of the Whalers for 18 years. He's an NHL broadcast Hall of Famer. We weren't a megalopolis, you know, we were sitting between Boston and New York and we were uh, kind of the David to the Goliaths in the NHL. But uh, it was always good to be the little guy that would upset the big guy. At the park, it's a three-day power play, celebrating puck drops and slap shots. And here, the blue and green still reign supreme. It's all about the community and, and, and the passion, and we, we try to give our fans the, the best experience possible and to bring a former NHL team back, and, you know, and, and some of their alumni, and uh, it, I, I think is real special. And this year's Whalers Alumni Weekend happening Friday, Saturday, Sunday as the Yard Goats host the Somerset Patriots. Parenthetically, we will be there on Sunday for a charity benefiting the Jordan Porco Foundation, some of your favorite Fox 61 News personalities for Scooper Sunday. We have all the information at fox61.com and on the Fox 61 News app. Here at Duncan Park in downtown Hartford, Jim Altman, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.